<laughs> so there was a lot of good guesses, but nobody got it right. Um, Mech Warrior, that's a great... Wow, that's a really hot guess. Very, very, very close, Evil Homer. Very close. Uh, it's not Desert Strike. Not Desert Strike. Nobody guessed it. So the, the cutoff is hit. Unfortunately, nobody guessed it. Mech Warrior was such a close guess, though. Um, this is the game. It's called Earth Siege 2. And I hope Finn, I really hope Finn for the win has been working. So we're going to open this box. I'm going to get my knife. We open this up. It's a uh, mech combat game. It's very, very close. Very close mech warrior guess was like the closest guess. Well done. Good guess. Leave my knife. Oh, it's over here. No, that's not it. Where did I leave it? I think I left it in the other room. I'll be right back. I've been looking forward to doing this all day, so um, I can't wait to see what's inside the box. Now I'll show the box before I open it, just so that um, so that you can see. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's not a knife. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is Mech Warrior. Um, not Mech Warrior. This is a Mech Warrior-like game called Earth Siege Two. Uh, obviously, it's the second in the series. The Earth Siege uh, developers. Uh, went on to make Star Siege and Star Siege Tribes and Tribes 2. So this box has seen better days. You can see there's some damage right here. This is part of why I want to open it up, just so I can straighten out the box a bit. It's also damage on this side. Uh, and it's been, you can kind of see there's a bit of a depression in the box there too. So I'm just going to take this out. I was going to take it out to straighten it out anyway, but I can open it on stream. It's the first time, uh, it's not the first time I've opened a sealed game, but uh, it's the first time I've ever seen what the contents of this box would be. Played that game way back. Awesome, awesome grassroots. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, so let's uh, let's make an incision along the top here, between the, uh... Go. Try not to cut anything. It's actually harder to hold it up in front of me and do it, but hopefully we're not... Hopefully I don't cut any actual cardboard, just the plastic. That's all we want to do. Alright. <laughs> Medic doctor precision. <laughs> yeah. Alright, here we go. This is it. Open in the box now. Take all the plastic off. Not leaving any of the plastic on. Go. Now we can get a close look at the graphics on the box. A must have, according to what does that say? A must have, according to whom? I can't read it. It's it's not readable. Let me let me read it. Strategy Plus magazine. People want smell descriptors. Oh, I'll get to that. Don't you worry. <laughs> uh, there's the back of the box there. True 3D terrain and stunning sound effects. More Hercs, bigger Hercs, and a Herc in the air. Improved controls and cockpit in interface. Very nice, very nice. I'm not licking it, Mel. <laughs> I'm not gonna lick it. <laughs> um, <laughs> a must have, yeah, indeed, indeed. Is uh, to adult six plus? Is that what it says? It does say that. Yeah, there it is. Age is six plus. It's to adults. So let's uh, let's find out. Okay, hang on. It smells like cardboard. <laughs> Thank you for following Grassroots. I appreciate that. Um, we're PG thirteen here. Oh, are you? All right. Opening the box up. Thank you very much for all the follows tonight, everyone. Sorry I couldn't keep up with all the names. I did try. Yep, still smells... Hang on. Okay, yeah, it's, it smells like old... You know, like, uh... Old books. It has that papery smell. Inside, uh, the colour is... Is pretty... Pretty clean looking. Pretty clean looking. It's probably been sitting around for a while. Nice smell, it must be, uh, smell. 
Smell the 90s. It must be smelling. I'm smelling it, Brent. I am. Um. Okay. Ooh, the box is... Because of the damage to the sides of the box, this inner box is actually very difficult to slide out right now, so... I'll, um... Maybe I'll just try and straighten the edges just a little bit before I try and slide it out. Let's see if that, that helped. Well, I think it did a little bit. Yeah, that helped. Okay. But I've never seen what's inside this box, actually. I know Finn for the win posted recently, and he had a copy of this on the Discord, so I'm interested to see if, uh, like, how complete his is compared to this sealed one. Um, but again, like, this is a mech warrior like combat sim, uh, pilot a mech. Uh, the series was originally, so the, it started with Metal Tech Earth Siege, and it was originally going to be Battle Tech Earth Siege, or Battle Tech something something. But apparently the uh, licensing fell through with Fasa, and that's why this game didn't get that, that, um, it wasn't associated with it, I guess, at that point. So, I just emptied out everything from the box, the inner box. I'll have to straighten this all out before I put it on the shelf. But, um, here's the, the game itself. Oh, they're advertising Mission Force Cyberstorm, which is also... It's off-camera, but it's just over there. Just next to Sim Tower, which is the last box, the white box there. Um, Alright, let's take a look. So we've got... It looks like the manual is just one of those manuals that sits in the cover in the cover of the CD case. There's the Earth Siege 2 CD. Yeah. It looks very clean. It's never seen the light of day or anything, so... Um, take a quick look at this manual and flick through it and see if it's got any color or not. I don't know. Seems to be black and white. Installation guide. About the manual. Gee, there's not a lot in this. Like, normally manuals for these games are thick. Um, this one doesn't have a lot in it. Cool mech. Customer service numbers. Yeah, this is a very boring manual. Alright, what else do we have? We've got... Earth Siege 2 quick reference. So, joystick controls, complete keyboard command list, and whatever's going on up here. All of the uh, HUD information that you need. Heads down displays, heads up display, multifunction displays. Yeah, these, this is a, these games can be quite complicated. Like the, oh, lick the disc too? Actually, this smells great. It smells exactly like, you know, like an old book. Hmm. Registration card. I guess this is also an order form. Yep, it has the same sort of smell. So, but that's all the paper in there. I'm actually surprised it doesn't have a big manual. It's just got this little manual. I guess there might be online manuals, like digital manuals on the disc. Um, yeah, interesting. I, I would have thought there would be like a binder manual, like in the first one. I'll show you the first game in the series. It's just behind the screen here. Um, this is the first game in the series, and it has a chunky manual. I'll show you that. I'll pull that out and show you real quick. This is the Earth Seed 1 manual. It's chunky. It's like a full book. You know, lots and lots of content in here. I was expecting something like this from this game, but apparently they they decided not to do that for this one. Just put this back in. We'll continue looking at Earth Siege 2 for a second before I move on. But yeah, Earth Siege 2, that was the game that we were opening up. Um, I hope people enjoyed watching that. Bit of an event for me. I enjoyed opening it. Uh, again, this is the Earth Siege 2 cover. 
the sides have seen a little, they, the sides of this box have been crushed. They've seen better days, but that's why I am opening it. I'm going to straight, try and straighten this out. Um, give it a bit of an iron with a tea towel over it. It should, should come pretty straight and then it'll look nice. Hmm. Yeah, and then of course, just the contents of the box, we have the registration card and the CD and the quick reference. That's everything. That's the whole, that's the whole contents of this box. It's, I'm slightly disappointed that there's not a huge manual in there. But, uh, that's all right. 